Hi there everybody, Dan McCready here once again, and once again we are experiencing single digit temperature cold, as Rob Gilman calls it, pipe cracking cold here on the South Shore. So we figure it's time once again for the hot water experiment. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to get our hot water here from a ye old WATD Keurig, and we're just going to fill up this little cup right here and we'll go outside and just a little bit and we'll see how it goes. Now if this experiment works correctly and if it is cold enough, we'll be able to take this water, fling it into the air, and it should freeze pretty much instantly. It's going to be a fun little experiment that we do whenever the temperatures get cold enough here, but we're just going to fill up our hot, cup of hot water first, then we're going to traipse outside and we'll see what happens. So be outside in just a sec. All right, everybody, so we're here in the kind of alcove lobby of Broadcast House here at WATD. We've got the cup of hot water, and we're going to step outside, and we're going to try the experiment. Now, as you'll see here, I've got my coat on, got the scarf, got the hat. Want to keep make sure that you're bundled and in layers and cold like this, so just keep that in mind, and uh, be safe because it's still hot water and all that. So we're going to step outside. Let's give it a try. All right, here we are. Standing out in front of Broadcast House on this very cold evening. Here's our cup of hot water. Let's see how this works. There you go. It is indeed very, very cold here on the South Shore. Pipe cracking cold. So if you don't have to be out in it, don't be out in it. But if you do, dress warm, be safe, be careful, stay warm. Reporting from out in front of Broadcast House on a very, very cold South Shore evening, Dan McCready, WATD News.